Well, I got connected with Belair Sparking Wine through, uh, I think they communicate with my management. And then uh, we took it from there. I went through all their requirements and I was I was okay with that. That's where we started, started to be part of Belair team. And I, I'm, so, I'm, so, I'm so grateful to be part of them because all greatest are in that team. And the more this goes, the more I feel like we become more family and all that. That's what CF got. I even got a lot of collabo from Bel Air. Did a song with Ricky from Bel Air. I still got a lot of songs from, uh, which are in my story. I ain't out yet from Bel Air. So it's more than a family to me. Whatever uh, associate with my uh, music, with my career, it's more than a family to me. And I respect it so much. And I'm so proud to be, brand, I mean, to be a global brand ambassador of Bel Air Sparking Wine. Well, the advice that Rick Rose gave me, like, and that's the thing I will never forget, is that, like, whenever you need me, I got your back. It doesn't matter where you came from, where you at. As long as you work so hard, you pray so hard, you become more creative, you will get there. He even asked me if you ever thought of me and you having something like having a song together. I said, no, it was like a dream. I said, right, today we're here together, we're doing a song. So no matter where you came from, where you at, what you're doing, keep doing what you're doing, make sure you're more creative and you pray so hard, you will get there one day. Everything is possible in this world. The song Walker came from, uh, like, uh, I guess from Belay, as I said, we are, we are, we are family, from, we are Belay family, so it was easy that way. You know, I think maybe it would, it would have been like more difficult if I'm from outside of uh, Belay family. So since I'm from Belay family, so it became very easy for me. I, I remember I was in Tanzania, and Brett told me, like, I think, do you want to do something with Ricky? I was like, does this sound like a question? <laughs> it's not a question. Let's do it. And then right away, straight up, I sent the song. I sent to him, to Brett, and the whole lyrics and everything. And then I'm sure he sent it to Ricky, and he told me, like, Ricky liked the song. I was more happy. During my birthday was last year, October 2nd. That's where I was at the backstage. Like, no, no backstage. I was in the room getting ready to go to my birthday because I did my birthday at one of the hotels back home. So I took a room in the hotel. I was in the room changing my clothes so that I can go to the birthday. And then I saw on Instagram, like, Ricky posted a, like, a verse on my beat. And I said, like, oh, so he's now recorded. I'm like, he's in the studio recording. Then after that, Ray check on me and he said, like, you know what? I've got something for you. He sent me a song. And I was more happy because it was my birthday. So it was like a birthday gift. Yeah, that's why Waka came from. Well, for those who don't know who Brett is, Brett is the founder and CEO of Black Bel Air Sparking Wine. And for me, it's more than it's more than a brother, it's more than a boss to me. Like he's he always wants to see how he can help me. That's what uh, 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 I really like and respect about him because it's not about just since because maybe I'm a, I'm a, I am mean, I'm ambassador. It's not about me just giving me more like uh, adverts to do and all that. It's just about seeing on how also he can uplift my my talent, he can uplift my my career. The more this is like as I say, like we become more family, and he's trying to see how he can help me as well to achieve more in my career. So it's more than a brother to me. It's more than it's, yeah, I can say that. But.